Just been what we are learning today. All about rain. Yes. So, how do clouds and rain form? Can you remember how clouds and rain form? Warm air containing water vapor rises. As the warm air rises, it cools. Water vapor condenses into tiny dust particles in the air, forming a cloud droplet. Billions of cloud droplets together form a cloud. Cloud droplets join up to make larger, heavier droplets which fall as rain. Great! Now types of rainfall. Types of rainfall. One, conventional rainfall. Rain formed when the cloud heats up during warm sunny weather. So this is the At sun? One, the sun heats the ground causing any moisture to evaporate and form water vapor. As the warm air rises it cools and condenses into clouds and eventually rain it is the conventional that sun heat and then go up and then this is okay conventional rain formed when conventional rain formed when the ground heats up during warm sunny weather the type of rainfall is most common in the south and east for uk can you suggest a reason why these areas are usually warmer and have more sunshine. Convention conventional rainfall is very common in the tropical rainforest. Can you suggest why? Ah, uh, but that is also sunny and warm. That is why, yeah. Now, second type of rain. Tell me, it Relief is relief rainfall. Rain formed when air is formed to rise over a hill or mountain. Relief means the shape of the land. 1. The prevailing wind brings warm, moist air from the ocean. The air is forced to rise over hills or mountains. 3. The air arising air cools and the water vapor condenses to form clouds and rain. So it is in the hail, that relief, yeah? And then as the air descends on the other side of the mountain, it warms up and becomes drier. So here it is rain, there is not rain. So in this side there's rain, in this side no rain. Okay. Then relief rainfall is most common. Relief rainfall is most common along the west coast of the UK. Yeah. Can you suggest a reason why? There are hills and mountains along the west coast of the UK which force moist air from the Atlantic Ocean to rise. And last one is frontal rainfall. Frontal rainfall. To understand how frontal rainfall forms, you need to know about air masses. What is air masses? What is air mass? An air mass is a large mass of air which moves over the Earth's surface. The temperature of an air mass depends on where it has come from. For example, a polar mass, mass comes from the polar regions so it will bring cold air. Wow, polar area is cold, isn't it? So, it, this is all what, tropical, it is too tropical at one poly. We will look at air masses in, in hmm. more detail in the next few lessons. lessons. Then frontal air occurs frontal in... Frontal rainfall occurs when two air masses meet. Means air one? Warm air less dense, fronts cold air denser. When a warm air mass meets a cold air mass, they do not mix. They have... Different denses, cold air denser, warm air less dense. The warm, less dense air is forced to rise over the cold, dense air. This is called a front. Yeah, this is cold one that called front, yeah? Then the warm? The warm air cools and the water vapor condenses into 
clouds and rain. So here one and cold the other meet in this and then form this cloud and then causes this is called the frontal air fall. Frontal who happens? Frontal rainfall can happen anywhere in the UK. Can you suggest a reason why this type of rainfall can happen anywhere in the UK? Because the air masses can meet anywhere. However, air masses frequently meet over the Atlantic Ocean. So the frontal rainfall is very common on the West Coast. West Coast, it is more common, yeah? So, Complete your rainfall. Yeah, we can do that. Seat. Okay, so you can see three types. Conventional, relief, and frontal. So conventional, just sun giving this, you know, vaporing this water and water goes and happen. And relief is in the hill. One side of the hill. Relief is in the hill. And frontal is when cold and it, uh, cold and warm wills. Frontal, frontal. Well, frontal. Yes, frontal. when it warm and cold air masses, they meet. That time, there is frontal. So three times. You know now, isn't it, Jasmine? Is it good or not? Yeah? So, we'll uh, learn anything else. Tomorrow we will learn something else. Bye for today.